A fairy is a type of mythical being or legendary creature in European folklore, and a form of spirit often described as supernatural. This video is believed to show a dead fairy. A dragon is a legendary creature typically scaled or fire spewing and with reptilian traits that features in myths of many cultures around the world. Even though modern science will tell you that these creatures do not exist, some will disagree. Over the years there have been many supposed dragons caught on camera, each resembling giant winged creatures with long necks. This supposed dragon was spotted in a cave. When the video was first uploaded a few years back many thought this was finally proof that dragons exist. But as with many of these dragons, this one can be explained. The creature in this video is an Ulm. The Ulm, also known as the Cave Salamander, is a blind amphibian exclusively found in the underwater caves of southern European lakes and rivers. The Ulm is also known as the human fish, which refers to the colour of its skin. It's most well known for living its entire life in the darkness of underwater caves which has led this species to adapt quite strangely to life without light. The most notable feature of the Ohm is the fact that it's blind as its eyes are not properly developed, and instead it must rely on incredible hearing and smell to understand its surroundings. In a similar way to the axolot, the Ohm does not undergo the drastic transformation from young to adult in the same way that frogs and toads do. The Ohm is also entirely aquatic, hunting, mating, eating and sleeping in the darkness of the underwater caves. As with other amphibious animals, the Ohm is a carnival, meaning it gets all of its nutrition it needs from eating other animals. Small invertebrates are the main source of food for the Ohm, including worms, aquatic insects, larvae and snails. Due to the fact that the Ohm lives out its life in the safety of a dark underwater cave, it has fewer predators than it would living in both the water and on land. Fish and other amphibians are the primary predators of the Ohm, along with a very occasional rodent or bird. Today, due to rising levels of water pollution, own populations are declining meaning that it's now considered to be vulnerable to extinction in their native environment. While some think of the Cyclops of Greek mythology, a rare creature dubbed a one-eye anomaly by the National Geographic was discovered in 2011, and still continues to baffle scientists today. The term Cyclopea describes a congenital defect in animals, characterised by the fusion of the orbits into a single cavity containing one eye. In mid-2011, Fisherman Enrique was trolling the waters near the Gulf of California. When Enrique showed his find it was instantly regarded as a cryptid and a hoax. However, after Enrique brought the specimen to National Geographic scientists, the Cyclops was found to be an actual real animal. The 22 inch long fetus has a single functioning eye at the top of its head, the hallmark of the congenital condition called Cyclopea, which occurs in several animal species including humans. When Enrique passed the shark over to the scientists they x-rayed the fetus, and reviewed previous research on Cyclopea in other species to confirm that the find is indeed a cyclop shark. Cyclop sharks have been documented by scientists a few times before, the fact that none of these have been caught outside the womb suggests cyclop sharks don't survive long in the wild. Overall, finding such an unusual animal reinforces that scientists still have a lot to learn. The scientists said that it's a humbling experience to realise you haven't seen it all yet. A fairy is a type of mythical being or legendary creature in European folklore. Fairies are genuinely described as human in appearance and having magical powers. Small fairies of one kind or another have been recorded for centuries, but there have also been fairies depicted as ranging in size from very tiny up to the size of a human child. Manchester artist John Hyatt took some photographs of the landscape around Rossendale in Lancashire, but when he enlarged those images he noticed they showed tiny winged creatures that looked like fairies. In an email to the Huffington Post, Hyatt said that he spotted the tiny creatures after taking pictures at dusk. 
He said he was taking photographs of the sunset through the trees and when he enlarged the photographs later in the studio he saw those figures. They are not doctored apart from he increased the size of a detailed section of a larger photograph. He said the creatures in the photos don't look like normal insects. He said it was a bit of a shock when he blew them up. He then went out afterward and took pictures of flies and they didn't look the same. But there could be another explanation. The midge. Midges are tiny flying insects with a wingspan of only 2 to 3 millimeters. There's over 35 different species of biting midge in the United Kingdom. The Highland midge prefers to lay its eggs in slightly acidic habitats, typically peaty soils containing favorite plant like rushes. When they're not biting, they like to hide in long bracken or amongst moss on tree bark. This type of habitat dominates western areas of Scotland. When you compare the two side by side, they do look alike, but there are some that are convinced that John did capture a real life fairy. But what do you think? Let me know in the comments what you think it is. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more countdown videos.